Yo, what's up, YouTube? How are you guys doing? And welcome back to more Let's Play Pokemon Black Version. In the last episode, we got our second gym badge from Gym Leader Lenora, the basic badge. And there was a little bit of a cliffhanger here. Uh, something happened with some scientists or something. I don't know, but let's go ahead and check it out. So let's go ahead and make our way out of this gym. But that was a good gym battle, not gonna lie. But yeah, let's go ahead and make our way outside and see what's up with the place. Because I do not know what, what happened. And uh, yeah, something's going on. Now you wait, not fooling around. Whoa, what's going on? Whoa, Team Plasma and everyone's here. Whoa, what's going on, man? So you become gym leader. We Team Plasma claim this museum's Dragon School in the name of Pokemon Liberation. Uh, yeah, dude. Whoa, this Dragon School? It, that's Dragonite, right? Well, then here's our smoke screen. Uh, whoa, what's going on, man? Smoke screen? Yo, yo, what are y'all doing? Uh, y'all good? What's going on? Whoa, they just stole... What's going on? Y yeah, yeah, what is going on, dude? Oh, we have to go after them. Okay, oh, they stole the dragon skull head. I just noticed that. Okay, let's go ahead and follow Team Plasma and see what's up with this place. Because, uh, yo, what's what's Team Plasma up to right now? Lenora, uh, you, you good? What happened? Ooh, looks like it's Berg. Good day, Lenora. Find any fossils lately? This is a surprise visit. Are you suffering from artist's block again? <laughs> Was that supposed to be a joke? I don't, I don't know. This is Berg. He may not look like it, but he's uh, Castilla City's gym leader. He may not look like it, I guess. I guess, I mean, he does look like a gym leader, to be honest. But, uh, yeah. And it looks like Bianca's here. Hello, Bianca. Oh, Vlaggy, what's everybody doing here? I don't know. This is confusing. Vlaggy, is there some kind of problem? Uh, yeah, there is a little bit of a problem here. Team Plasma did something, and, uh, yeah. Okay, let's split up and search. I'll head this way. Uh, which way? Everyone, Sharon and Bianca, I want you to stay here at the museum. Berg and Vlaggy go search the uh, Pinwheel Forest. Okay, so it looks like we're going to be going with Berg to search and uh, to the Pinwheel Forest. Uh-huh, yeah. Uh-huh, you're Vlaggy, is it? Are you raising your round to round up uh, robbers? I guess so, man. But, uh, yeah. Oh, Vlaggy, take this with you. Fennel gave, it to, uh, gave this dowsing machine to you. Oh, it looks like we got that dowsing machine thing, the one that uh, helps us get items and all that stuff. So, yeah, this is the one. This is like, I'm pretty sure this is it, right? The one, that, yeah, this is the one that helps us find items and all that stuff, but uh, yeah. For now, all we need to do is to uh, protect the museum, right? Yeah, just go protect the museum, guys. You, Sharon, uh, you and Sharon over there, and uh, well, I'm gonna go ahead and go with Berg and see what's up with the forest. So yeah, let's go ahead and make our way to the forest. Where did Berg go? I'm pretty sure Berg went so quickly, but uh, oh wait, 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 hold up, hold up, man, hold up, man. I was about to do something. Uh, I was about to go into that pinwheel forest. And start this whole thing, but without healing up my Pokemon. I forgot they're still fainted from that gym battle. So, I mean, maybe maybe Berg was going to heal up our Pokemon anyways. But uh, maybe not. So, you know, I don't want to take the risk. I mean, maybe he was not going to heal up our Pokemon. So, I don't know. But, I mean, like, Sharon did it one time. I mean, so, like, it, it, it really like it really does all depend, you know. Uh, like, it really all de depends. Because it's not always going to be all the time. You know, one time Sharon healed up my Pokemon... Like, two episodes ago, I don't freaking remember, but then when I actually needed to heal up my Pokemon, he didn't want to heal it up for some reason. I don't know. But yeah, are we, are this lady still going to ask us for a battle? Okay, never mind. Yeah, there's a crisis going on. You're not going to be asking me for a battle. I'm kind of busy right now. Let's see Supremio Forest. If they message to, uh, to scuttle off into the forest, we might have some trouble. Yeah, let's go ahead and follow Berg into the Pimio Forest right here. And uh, yeah, let's go ahead. and uh, Hopefully, none of these trainers ask us for a battle because, you know, they are going to, uh, I mean, they're, they're going to bother us right here. Well, you see, there are two ways out of Pinwheel Forest. The road that goes straight into the path and winds into the woods. And I'll take the straight road after them. If they're not here, I'll block the exit. Uh, would you please take the other... Okay, so it looks like we're going to be taking the left side. Um, yeah, come on, let's do it for Lenora's sake. Okay, uh, okay, Berg, leave us alone, man. But uh, yeah, it looks like we got some... Uh... Oh, shoot, I accidentally went into that. Man... Um, I really want to speed up, but I mean, like I said, it, it really messes up the game. Like, whenever there's a cutscene, it's going to make it all glitchy. Or, I don't know, I haven't tried it, but I mean, I'm scared it might do it. The problem is, if it happens, I don't think there's, go I don't think there's, like, I don't think there's no way to go back to normal. So, uh, yeah. Uh, Spring, you go ahead and just come back out. Not, not come back out, but really, dude, I really want to speed up these battles, but I don't know. Should I just risk it? Because, I don't know, man. I, don't, I really do not want the cutscenes. I want the cutscenes to come out good, you know, not just to come out... Like, all glitchy and everything, but, you know, I don't know, man. But I'm just going to go for some more tackles right here for the Sea Waddle, uh, Sawaddles, or whatever they're called. I usually call them Sea Waddle or Sawaddles. I guess Sawaddle is a nice, the correct way to say it because, it, you know, the anime said it. So, I guess that's the correct way 
Actually, good thing we have Ace who knows Air Cutter, which uh, hits two Pokemon at a time. So that'll actually be pretty good on us. And with that, you know, that'll actually be super effective, yo. And yeah, yeah. Wow, wow. Wow, that's a waddle. Uh, did not, it didn't go down. Air Cutter should have, like, one hit KO'd it or something, I guess. But I guess not. Nah. Anyways, uh, yeah, we might actually be in a bit of a trouble here. Hopefully, someone will kill up our Pokemon. Um... Like along the way or something, but yeah, hopefully someone will heal up our Pokemon because we need to be we need to get healed up here because we're about to. I mean, look at our Pokemon. I mean, not really. I mean, I, I'm pretty sure it's just Vines. Vines the only one that has low HP. But yeah, let's go ahead and continue on here. Uh, we got some Team Plasma Grunts. Can we avoid them though? Oh shoot! You stubborn brat. When I'm through with you, you won't be able to chase us anymore. Uh, yeah, it looks like we're gonna be battling I guess another Team Plasma Grunt right here. Uh, man, I really want to skip the battles, dude. I don't, I don't know, man. I mean, it's gonna make the cutscenes all weird and everything, and everything. But yo, Sandile, cool. Hey, a Sandile, that's a really cool Pokemon. Uh, Sandile is Intimidate, yeah. But I mean, no, no, that, that really is a cool Pokemon, Sandile. I like that Pokemon. Let's go ahead and go for Water Gun right here. This is actually our first time seeing a uh, Sandile in the Let's Play. I guess it's rather, I guess it's re registered to the Pokedex. So uh, yeah, Sandile has been registered to the Pokedex here. But yeah, let's go. Oh wait, we can't use the same move? Oh yeah, that's how Torment works, huh? I always forget about Torment. Every time someone uses Torment, I always forget that you can't use the same move twice. So yeah, I always keep forgetting about that. Okay, oh yeah, I forgot again. But uh, yeah, see, I forgot again. But uh, yeah, I, I, I completely forgot that's what Torment does. But, yeah, anyways, there we go. We have defeated Crocodile. Not Crocodile, just... Uh, what is his name again? Sandow. Yeah, I always get, I got confused. But yeah, uh, too bad. I haven't got anything. You want to get back? You're going you're gonna to have to... Look for my associates. Who are your associates, man? Uh, wait, we need to heal up, man. I, th I think these Team Plasma Grunts. I think you can't avoid the Team Plasma Grunts because they're gonna, they're gonna just uh, walk up to you. Uh, we don't. Oh man, we're really out of. Wow, we're, we're really low on. On our stuff, man. Uh, I guess. I don't know, man. Hopefully, someone will heal up our Pokemon, in a bit right here. But let's try to avoid this Team Plasma Grunts. I'm pretty sure if you, yeah, if you just get near him. He will go up to you and battle you or something like that. But uh, yeah, let's go ahead and uh, defeat this little Team Plasma Grunt right here. Man, I really just want to... I don't really want to bore you guys out with the battles, you know? But I mean, I guess... I'll ho you know what? I'll try to find a way to navigate myself around. I'll try to find a way to speed up, you know, without actually having some uh, technical uh, issues. Not really technical issues, just... Uh, like, I'm pretty sure, like, if I use speed up, the only thing... Like, it, it's, everything still runs fine, you know? Everything's still good. It's just the only thing that... That uh that might be affected is the the cutscenes. You know, whenever you battle, like whenever you battle Sharon and Bianca, and whenever that versus uh whenever that versus screen pops up, you know, like every time you go against somebody like a gym leader, or you know, and trainer Pokemon trainer Anne or Bianca and Sharon, you know how there's that versus cutscene right there. You know, like like right, like right before the battle, um that, that's like the only thing that gets affected really, to be honest. Okay, whoa, 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 oh, that's that lag right there. But uh yeah, that's the only thing that gets affected really. I mean, I don't know. But yeah, uh, there's a youngster guy right there. It looks like we can't avoid him. Fudge. Let's try to let's, let's try to go avoid him if we can. I mean, let's try to avoid him if we can. Come on, look the other way, man. Look at the other way, dude. Come on. Yeah, here we go. Oh shoot. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Looks like we couldn't. Um. Looks like we couldn't avoid him. But you know, it's okay, man. Uh. Yeah. We're challenged by youngster Nicholas right here. He's gonna send out Venipede. Venipede. Cool. I've never seen that Pokemon right in this Let's Play. So let's go ahead and take a Venipede down right here. And something's going on, man. Something's... I don't know what's going on here. But let's go ahead and send out Ace right here. Our uh, little flying type Pokemon. Actually, Ace... Ace actually evolves pretty early, not gonna lie. It evolves like a level 21. So this is actually gonna be pretty good right here. Let's go ahead and go for Air Cutter right here. And try to take this, uh... Vinipede down. And yeah, hopefully everything works out. Okay, yeah, it used uh, Protect. I forgot about that. Yeah, hopefully this Air Cutter will do pretty good. Hopefully it won't... Yeah, there we go. Vinipede use Screech. Okay, nice. Let's go ahead and go for Air Cutter right here. And Vinipede use Protect. Okay. Vinipede, you go ahead and protect yourself all you want. But we're actually going to go ahead and uh, take you down. Poison Sting. Wow, that Poison Sting looked like it hurt. But yeah, there we go. Let's go ahead and take Vinipede down. And Vinipede has been defeated. Good thing he only has one Pokemon. I think, right? Yeah, hopefully. No, he has Timber. Oh, shoot. Okay, good thing it's another Pokemon that uh, is weak to flying type. So this is actually going to be pretty easy right here. But yeah, let's just go ahead and go for some air cutters and take this timber down right here, man. And uh, yeah, timber use focus energy. Okay, timber, go ahead. But you know what, guys? You know, uh, feel free to skip 
past the battles if you want i actually do not mind because you know it's 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 you know it's my problem but yeah yeah but yeah like feel free to skip through the battles like the trainer battles if you want if and if you guys want to get back to the normal whatever whatever it is you you more like you more than welcome to i honestly do not mind because you know i'm honestly i'm still figuring out what to do with the uh, speed up and all that but yeah there's like uh, there's a water pokemon right here it's going to be a venipede okay let's just go ahead and run away from this venipede right here actually what level is spring 16 or okay no never 18 never mind i thought it was still level 16 that's why i was kind of scared because you know how when you find a water pokemon and if you're not higher like high leveled enough it won't let you escape so uh yeah oh uh, come on which way do we go dude Fudge, there's a, uh, looks like there's a, uh, uh, what do you call it, what is this, a Pokemon Ranger right here, yeah, it looks like we're gonna be battling against Pokemon Ranger Audra, who's gonna send out Pansage, okay, this is actually not too bad, because at least we're going against Pokemon that are weak to flying type, so this is actually gonna be pretty, okay, you know what, oops, wrong Pokemon right there, but uh, yeah, we're actually going against Pokemon that are really weak against flying type, so I guess, uh, our little P-Dove will have some, we'll be having a good time right here, you know, with these, uh, Pokemon that are weak to its flying types, but yeah, well, why would we not do too much? Let's go ahead and take it down with some air cutters right here, and hopefully take this little Pansage down in one hit. If we, okay, never mind. Pansage is actually level 18. I don't think one hit KO was actually possible right here. Maybe a two hit KO. If, that, if that's even a thing, I don't think that is. But uh, yeah, it looks like he's gonna go for uh, false swipes or fury swipes. I don't know what that move was. I think it's fury swipes. I don't think false swipes goes more than once. Wow, five times. That, that, isn't that like the maximum like five times or something like that but uh yeah there we go we had defeated uh pan sage right there and there we go man we're doing pretty good and uh, yeah we defeated pokemon uh ranger audra and let's go ahead and continue right here um uh, but yeah looks like we received we received a chesto berry that's actually pretty nice thank you audra let's go ahead and uh hopefully that little okay yeah yeah hopefully that little green thing did not uh, the trainer did not pop up from there um Okay, good thing that, uh, okay, yeah, we're doing pretty good. Let's go ahead and navigate ourselves around here. Um, hopefully we can avoid these little green, what are these, what are those little green things actually? Like little green, like what are those little green things supposed to be exactly? Um, are they supposed to be like, uh, like little hills or what are they supposed to be? Actually, how do people even hide in those, dude? Is that even like a real thing? Do people, can, can people actually hide under the, under the grass with those little green things like that? Like, ooh, that, well, like, where all the Pokemon Rangers and all them hide. But, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and go for a Super Potion right here and heal up our Pokemon. Because no one's healing up our Pokemon right here, man. No one's no one's helping us out. And maybe that just means that I should be healing up or stocking up on some items whenever we reach the cities. But, uh, yeah, it looks like we got a Wild Venipede right here. Sorry about this, guys. But uh, I'll try to figure out uh, something about speed up, you know, all that next episode. But, you know what? Screw it. Let's just go ahead and uh, keep on going right here. And, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and make our way towards right here. And, uh, yeah, there we go. We found our Team Plasma Grunts. All right. Let's go ahead and take this guy down right here for, like, the 10th time or, like, the 10th battle we've had already. I don't know how many battles we've had already. But, yeah, uh, yeah um, good thing he has only one Pokemon. So, this is actually going to be pretty easy. So, uh, yeah, uh, Ace, you go ahead and, you know, take these little pad traps down. Um, let's go ahead and go for some wing attacks. No, not wing attacks. Air cutters. Uh, Ace does, still doesn't know wing attack yet, but man, these pad traps, man. These pad traps, wow, they're really giving us a trouble, man. I swear, man. These little pad traps like to give us like a lot of trouble. I don't know why. They're over here one hit carrying my Pokemon. They're over here using protect and all that stuff. Man, these pad traps are really, they really are a pain. But you know what? Let's go ahead and just take them down anyways. Pad trap use crunch. Okay, pad trap. Come on, man. Just try, not, try not to make this too hard on us right now. Right here, you know, it's, it's just like a little forest, pinwheel forest battle, you know, it shouldn't be too hard, man. But yeah, there we go, let's go ahead and go take it down. One more should be able to do it. And uh, Ace is running out of air cutters right here, so we gotta be careful. We gotta try our best not to, uh, we gotta try our best to, uh, to defeat it as quick as we can, you know. Come on, man, what, what happened? Why, why couldn't Ace, why, why didn't Ace use an air cutter when something happened? I wasn't paying attention. You know, half of the time when I'm battling, I don't really pay attention to... You know, I just, I don't know, I, I really don't, like, 100% focus. Only when it's, in the, only when it's a, like, uh, when it's, like, a gym battle or something like that. That's, that's that's probably the time where I pay most attention. But literally, like, most of the time, I'm not really paying attention. I Like, I am paying attention, but not, like, 100% to the point where I know where everything is going on and all that stuff. But, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and navigate ourselves around here. Uh, shoot. We got about one of these trainers. Yeah, it looks like it's going to be Pokemon Ranger here. Let's just go ahead and just take this guy down right here. But I'm, like, I really am, like, I really am sorry about that, guys, you know, about that whole trainer battle. I really want to skip it, but, you know, like I said, I don't want to, 
I'll figure out something on the next episode, you know. I'll try to figure out. Hopefully, we can be able to do it next time. But yeah, let's go ahead and go for air cutter right here. And uh, Pan uh, Pantio went for incinerates. That reminds me of Chili's Pantio. Okay, yeah, Ace has been taken down. I forgot about that. I forgot Ace was low HP. You see, I'm over here. Uh, I'm over here not really paying 100%, like 100% like to the, to the gym battles. Like I'm not paying like attention, like you know, completely, you know, 100%. Uh, I guess you can say, but uh, yeah. There we go, Pantsir's gonna go for some Fury Swipes, man. Chill with that Fury Swipes, Pantsir. Oh my gosh, dude. It's gonna use all of them, man. Wow, we barely survived that, wow. But I mean, Pantsir, man, you went, you went ahead and used those Fury Swipes, dude. I Actually, Fury Swipes is actually a pretty, uh, like it does, I guess it does do pretty, pretty good damage, you know, I guess. Uh, because, you know, if you use, like, if you use Fury, Fury Swipes, like, five times, dude, that, like, that does some serious damage right there. Uh, looks like he gave us a Petra Berry right here. Thank you. Uh, uh, what, what, what are you again? Uh, Pokemon Ranger. Yeah, we, I don't really see a lot of those here. But yeah, let's go ahead and see what's up here. And well, what's up, man? A pursuer. Uh -huh, a kid like you uh, beat some of us. That can't be help. Uh, I'll take you on now. All right, so here we go. Last Team Plasma Grunt member for the day. Maybe I'm not sure. Uh, yeah, it looks like we got. Oh, he has three Pokemon. My goodness. Alright, you know what? He, um, I guess... It's alright, man. It's alright, it's alright. But, um, yeah, let's just go ahead and go for uh, speed up right here. Why not? Um, you know, I guess I'll use speed up whenever whenever everything's normal, you know? But whenever we're gonna, we're gonna go against, like, a good trainer, whenever it's, like, a gym battle, I'll try not to use speed up. But, yeah, let's go ahead and take this uh, Team Plasma. Man, I should've used speed up since the beginning. My bad, guys. I should've used speed up. Since the beginning, I don't know what I was doing, but uh, yeah, this, uh, you see this uh, like this speed up makes everything go a little bit faster. But yeah, there we go. We had to feed a sand out right there, and vines go up to level 23. Nice, and yeah, fine. I'll take your stupid school. And there we go. We have received the uh, what is that? The dragon school, whatever the thing is. Yeah, we received one of those, and uh, yeah, whoa, we got whoa, we got one of the seven sages right here. Gorm, are you holding up for subject for our king? Gorm the Seven Sages. I mortified this skull which we went out so much trouble to obtain. It was stolen from us so early. Oh, yeah. What is going on with Team Plasma right here, dude? They're over here stealing stuff and doing bad things, man. But, uh, yeah. Ooh, Berg. What's up, my dude? Uh, how, how you doing, man? But, uh, yeah. Lunora. Lunora is here, too. Yeah, everybody's here, man. What about Bianca and Sharon? Oh, yeah. I forgot. They had to stay at the uh, museum. They can't come with us. I forgot. They. That was their job. And our job was to come here. That's why we're over here with everybody and all the... And all the, what do you call it? I don't know, and, and all the action, I guess. They're a speedy bunch. What do you plan to do, Berg? Are you going to chase them? Hmm. We got back to the Solomon School. If we corner them, there's no telling what they might do. I think they'll be heading back to Nora. Well, well I'll, I'll be waiting for your challenge at the Castillo City's Pokemon Gym. Oh, the Castillo City Pokemon Gym. I am looking forward to that too, Berg. Hopefully, we'll be going up to the Castillo City soon. And meeting up with Berg to get our third gym badge. And she looks like uh, Lenora gave us a school. I guess she's uh, she trusts us, you know, enough to to receive the school. And she also gave us some Moonstone. Okay, uh, yeah, some Pokemon do evolve with the Moonstone and all that stuff. But yeah, uh, well, that is actually going to be it for today's episode. Next episode, we will be going on out of Pilmio Forest and actually hopefully make it to Castil uh, Castilia City. So yeah, guys, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoy it, and I'll be seeing you guys in the next episode. So until then, guys, peace out.